This month's journey is going to be on a, uh, a guy who kind of helped me motivate, motivated me to get my own set of high top locks. Um, honestly, it was just one of those things. I seen this image and I was just basically a get with like, yep, this is it. This is what I, I want. Um, the guy's name is Farai Shepard. Uh, don't know much about him from Chicago, I, I believe. He kicks it with most depth, though. This is uh, or Yasin B, which is pretty cool. But um, it's a writer. Uh, um, from what I've seen, though, far as his high top blocks, um, you know, it was just something unique and fresh at the time that I seen it. Um, I was rocking a mohawk. I was getting tired of the mohawk. It was already on his on his downfall. And I still had a little bit of hair. I was rocking a high top, I think, too. And it was just at the point where I was just like, you know, I was looking for something new. And this was like, I think at that, within like that three months, three, four months span, uh, I seen this and it, it only took one look and I was just like, yeah, this is it. This is what I was going to rock with. Um, I seen this image, this particular image on Instagram. And, uh, yeah, I just rocked with it. Um, I never asked him any questions on how he got his hair like that. But from what I seen on, um, on his Instagram, he posted a throwback Thursday photo. And apparently this guy been growing his locks since 2005. So he's like the original representative of uh, the high top locks. That man, he's been, he been in the game for about 11 years with it. So as you can see, though, they, they very unique. You know what I'm saying? Um, it does look like he got a, some longevity because it's like you could tell they like built up. You know, a bush up in there with I've been trying to trying to accomplish, which to probably come come soon. But as you can see in this video, um, let's see, if I can get a good. See. But as you can see, <laughs> that mop, it definitely got some years. It definitely got some years in the game. Um. Yeah, I don't know. Like I said, I think he's been growing it since 2005. I'm um, not sure what he does. Um, from what it looks like, he does a little bit of separation. I doubt if he's getting them retwisted anymore these days. Maybe in the beginning he started off with the with the with the uh, a loctician, and he probably just let it go from there. Um, From what I see, his curl pattern might be a lot different from mine. Uh, I'm not sure what else, though. Um, it looks thick in that joint, so I, I, I would say he probably stopped separating him probably like four years ago. Two, three years ago, maybe. Um... Uh, yeah, that's, yeah, that's all I can really get you from that. Um, he has a couple of videos online where he's, you know, where you can actually get some, a viewpoint from off these joints. You can see he still maintains his size. But these, you know, you, I don't really know how old these videos are because this look a lot shorter than what it was in the other videos. So this is probably a little more. Well, that, that video, the other video was probably a little bit more relevant than this one is. Um, uh, I mean, this journey seemed like it's been going like the same way, probably the same way Miles has been going. Not too much. Miles is like more, it's not wild and crazy to the, you know, to the south. Miles pretty much go in one direction and my sides is not as, uh, doesn't dangle as much as his does. Um, I 
I, I really don't know what he does with his joints, man. It's a, it's a good question. I would, I would probably ask him, but yeah, it's, it'll be, it'll be interesting to see what he says, what's his response to these. But um, yeah, this is the guy for Rod Shepard, man, who kind of gave me the motivation to, to pull this, this deuce, this do, this main. This uh, high top lock game off. So, you know, if you can't look him up, man, he's on, you know, you can look up some Google search images, some uh, Instagram photos of him. Um, he's a writer, though, so, uh, you know, you might find more articles on some of his. Uh, literature online but yeah this is the guy man for Rice Shepherd. I'm not sure who your motivation was behind your lock high tie locks if you had any but this was kind of my uh my inspiration if I was uh but yeah man so you know this is the high lock high top lock journey for you this month lock review of Ferrari Shepherd all right now, y'all stay blessed. Peace.